Now we're going to start talking about the actual test and this is what I, you know, what I want to focus. With. Now, the Bergen Academy's test is a um, short test. It's one hour and 45 minutes and it is divided into two parts. The first part is your essay and they usually give the essay or the writing portion of the test first, then they give the math portion of the test. That is usually what they do. Of course, they can change that if they want. So this year they can give you the math first and then the writing. But usually what they do is they give you the essay first and then the math. So for the essay, you're going to have one essay that you need to write. And this one essay you need to write in 45 minutes. Okay. You will get a story, a short story, about three pages long, two pages, three pages. You will need to read the story understand the story, look for a few tips, markers, things we're going to learn together in the story, and then start writing an essay, answering a question about the story, and you will need to get evidence, supportive evidence, from the story and put it into your essay. You need to finish all this in 45 minutes, perfectly well, neatly, and have everything you're looking for in there, and this we will learn in a lot more detail. Then you will have your math test. And for the math test, you guys have 40 questions that you need to answer in 60 minutes. So you're going to have exactly one hour to answer 40 questions. The 40 questions in math are usually divided into 20 easy questions and 20, let's not say hard, but let's say harder questions. With the first 20 questions usually being on the easy side and the next 20 questions usually being on the harder side. Again, don't take that as a rule. They can change that if they want. And it's very likely to have a couple of hard questions in the first 20 easy questions and a couple of easy questions in the second half 20 harder questions. So it's not always like 20 very easy questions and 20 very hard questions. No, it's kind of gradual, but the first half of the test are, is usually easier than the second half of the test. And this is something really important. It's part of the things that we are going to learn together. Like imagine if you didn't know what I just said, okay? And you go and you take the test and you take your time in the first 20 questions. Like, you know, you don't, you're, you're not rushed and everything is okay. And then you discover that the first 20 were actually really easy and the next 20 are much harder and you need so much more time. Then you will not be able to finish the test on time and you won't get a good score. But now that you know this information, you should be mentally prepared to work faster on the first 20 questions and then take more time on the next 20 questions because the first half of the test is easier than the second half. So information like this is very important so you guys can be ready, prepared for the test.